हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल जर्नी विद विजय कुमार श्रीवास्तव टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी द टॉपिक रोल ऑफ मैन्योर्स एंड फर्टिलाइजर्स इन क्रॉप प्रोडक्शन बिफोर प्रेजेंटेशन आई वुड लाइक टू इंट्रोड्यूस माय सेल्फ आई एम विजय कुमार श्रीवास्तव आई हैव डन माइस एग्रीकल्चर विद स्पेशलाइज इन एरोनॉमी फ्रॉम जे बी पंत यूनिवर्सिटी एग्रीकल्चर एंड टेक्नोलॉजी पंतनगर इन नाइनटीन एंड प्रेजेंटली वर्किंग एज ए सीड प्रोफेशनल इन सीड इंडस्ट्री एंड एसोसिएटेड विद वन ऑफ द एम सो लेट्स मूव टू द प्रजेंटेशन मैन्योर्स Manures are the plant and animal wastes that are used as source of plant nutrients. They release nutrients after their decomposition. Manures can be grouped into bulky organic manures and concentrated organic manures. First one, bulky organic manures. These are consisting of farmyard manures (FIMs), compost from organic waste (night soil), sludge, sewage, green manures, and vermi compost, etc. Second is concentrated organic manures, which is referring oil cakes. Like edible or non-edibles from extracted from oil seeds, then blood meal, fish meal, and bone meal, etc. Fertilizers. Fertilizers are industrially manufactured chemical containing plant nutrients. Nutrient content is higher in fertilizers compared to organic manures, and nutrients are released almost immediately. There are three types of fertilizers. First one is state fertilizers. The state fertilizers are those fertilizers which supply only one primary plant nutrient, either nitrogen or phosphorus. और पोटास एग्जाम्पल यूरिया म्यूरोटो पोटास सेकेंड इज कम्प्लेक्स फर्टिलाइजर दिस इज डिफाइंड एज ए मेटेरियल कंटेनिंग ऑल थ्री प्राइमरी न्यूट्रिएंट्स लाइक नाइट्रोजन फास्फोरस पोटास एंड इज आल्सो डिजिग्नेटेड एज कंप्लीट कम्प्लेक्स फर्टिलाइजर वाइल्ड लाइफ फर्टिलाइजर मेटेरियल लाइक सेवनटीन 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 कम्प्लेक्स विच इज कंटेनिंग नाइट्रोजन फास्फोरस एंड पोटास इन द रेसी ऑफ सेवनटीन 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 देन थर्ड वन इज मिक्स फर्टिलाइजर ए मिक्सचर ऑफ मोर देन वन स्टेट फर्टिलाइजर्स which can supply more than one plant nutrient in the fertilizers are coming in two forms first one is solid fertilizers and second is liquid fertilizers role of manures and fertilizers first organic manures bind the sandy soil and improve its water holding capacity second organic manures open the clay soils and help in aeration for better root growth third organic manures add plant nutrients in a small percentage and also add micronutrients which are essential for plant growth fourth manures increases the microbial activity which helps in releasing plant nutrients to available form and fifth organic manures should be incorporated before the sowing or planting because of slow release of nutrients sixth fertilizers play an important role in crop production as they supply large quantities of essential nutrient to crops seventh fertilizers are manufactured in farms that are readily utilized by plants directly or after rapid transformation eighth fertilizers dose can be adjusted to suit the requirement as determined by soil testing Ninth balanced application of nutrient based on crop requirement is possible by appropriate mixing of fertilizers and 10th fertilizers applied as state fertilizers providing single nutrients or complex and mixed fertilizer based on crop requirement here to study agronomic interventions for enhancing fertilizer use efficiency there are different agronomic measures to be followed for improvement like first using best fertilizer source second using adequate rate and diagnostic techniques third usage of balanced fertilization fourth integrated nutrient management and fifth utilization of residual nutrients now we will discuss about each measures in details first one is using best fertilizer source identification of best source of fertilizer is prerequisite for better crop production source of fertilizer depends on crop and variety climatic and soil condition and availability of fertilizers like waste sources for nitrogen ammonical or nitrate fertilizers for phosphorus water soluble or citrate soluble fertilizers to be preferred in case of potassium mirota potas for sulfur sulfate or elemental sulfur then multinutrient fertilizers like map dap ssv and nitrophosphates and multinutrient mixtures several combinations of npk Uh, others are their fortified fertilizers like neem coated urea zinc coated urea boronated urea uh, ssp uh, coated ssp and npk mixtures etc second improvement measures using adequate rate and diagnostic techniques the fertilizer recommendations must be in adequate quantity so as to meet the demand of a crop at any point of growth the fertilizer supply is made by 
डायग्नोजिंग इट्स रिक्वायरमेंट बाय एनी ऑफ द फॉलोइंग मेथड लाइक फर्स्ट स्टेट रिकमेंडेड जनरलाइज फर्टिलाइजर डोज और ब्लैंकेट रिकमेंडेशंस सोयल टेस्ट बेस्ड फर्टिलाइजर रिकमेंडेशंस सोयल टेस्ट क्रॉप रेस्पॉन्स बेस्ड रिकमेंडेशंस प्लांट एनालिसिस फॉर डायग्नोजिंग न्यूट्रिय डिफिशेंसीज and chlorophyll meter and leaf color charts etc so these are the various measures to be identify the nutrient needs of the crop third measures for improving fertilizer use efficiency is balanced fertilization balanced fertilization includes adequate supply of all essential nutrients proper method of application right time of application and nutrient interrelationship now we will discuss about first one adequate supply of all essential nutrients due to more concentration and application on primary nutrients npk soils develop deficiency symptoms for secondary and micronutrients hence ignored element must be added with the npk may be in minor quantity to get higher yields in crops experimental results shown that about 20 to 25 kg of micronutrients application or two foliar spray increases the yield of crops up to 20% so we have to think about supply of other micronutrients and secondary nutrients additional to nitrogen phosphorus and potassium fertilizers second method for balancing proper method nitrogen and potassium can be applied as broadcasting and band placement water soluble phosphorus fertilizer are preferred to apply as band placement in neutral and alkaline soils cited soluble phosphorus fertilizers are applied as broadcast method in acidic soils sulfate form of सल्फर फर्टिलाइजर्स आर अप्लाइड एज ब्रॉडकास्टिंग और बैंड प्लेसमेंट वेर एज एलिमेंटल सल्फर एंड पाइराइट आर अप्लाइड एज ब्रॉडकास्टिंग मेथड माइक्रोन्यूट्रिएंट्स आर अप्लाइड इन माइनर क्वांटिटी एज फोलियर स्प्रे द वाटर सोलबल फर्टिलाइजर्स आर अप्लाइड इन फर्टिगेशन सो डिपेंड्स ऑन द फर्टिलाइजर नेचर वी हैव टू गो फॉर द प्रॉपर मैथड थर्ड बैलेंसिंग मैथड इज राइट टाइम अकॉर्डिंग टू फिजोलॉजी ऑफ क्रॉप in upland crops like we are giving in two splits at the time of seedling 3 to 5 weeks after first dose and in flooded dry there are three splits at the time of transplanting and after that three and six weeks after first dose so according to crop requirement and its physiology we have to choose the right timing for fertilizer application and fourth nutrient interrelationship antagonistic nature of fertilizer is to be considered while applying into the soil some of the fertilizers application in excess is cause loss to yield and quality of crops like application of excessive 120 kg phosphorus per hectare created an imbalance and reduced the seed and oil yields in soybean compared to 80 kg phosphorus per hectare so there should be optimum quantity fertilizer dose to be provided to crop fourth measures for improving fertilizer use efficiency is integrated nutrient management organic manures crop residues green manures bio fertilizers etc are used and blended in right manner along with inorganic fertilizer to meet the crop demand all the possible and available organic sources are to be utilized efficiently to reduce the usage of inorganic fertilizers fifth measures for improving fertilizer use efficiency is utilization of residual nutrients Some of the strategies to utilize the crop residue in efficient manner are knowledge on climatic conditions and carry over effects of residues and blending rightly on cereal legumes rotations mixing shallow deep rooted crop rotations So this was all about use of manures and fertilizers in crop production and agronomic interventions for enhancing fertilizer use efficiency My presentation ends here thank you very much See you again shortly. I have given here my YouTube channel details. Journey with Vijay Kumar Srastha. Having request, please visit the channel, subscribe it, and provide your kind and valuable feedback for further improvements in next presentations. Thank you.